Hey there, this is Lillian DeJesus from Tiger Lily Virtual Assistants, and today we're going to talk about creating a book cover for Kindle in Canva. Now, there are five elements in creating a cover for Kindle in Canva. The first element would be layouts, second would be photos, third would be filter, fourth would be fonts and text, and fifth would be your download option. When you're in canva.com, you'll see the layouts section and you'll click on the Kindle cover first of all, but once you get into the layout section, it'll give you an array of different types of layouts that you can choose from. You can use any of these, but change it to your liking and for your book. Once you find a layout that is great for you, you're gonna wanna change that photo. You don't want to have that same photo and have somebody else use that same one. So you're going to go ahead and look for a photo that would be good for your genre. You're going to look into different types of photos. Now you can look at the Canva free photos. If you don't see anything there, I have a link to a list of different photo sites and uh, that would help you find the photo that you need. Um, make it an original Book cover but then I want to change the filter because it's a bit dark and I want it to be fun looking so I'm gonna have a different filter um, so you can scroll through all the different filter options that Canva has and pick the one that would be best for you and uh, you want to make sure that your font is legible so that's really important you can also change the font. If you're not too crazy about this font, go ahead and change it at this time. When you're finished with your book cover, you're gonna go ahead and download it and you'll find the download button on the very top right and you can choose the JPEG format because that is what is needed on Kindle. On the Amazon KDP end, they're going to ask for a JPEG format and then you're all set. Please feel free to leave a comment. Let me know if there are any more questions you have. Take care.